Hi there, Lee Benton of Lee Benton Ministries International. I just wanted to say a quick happy Thanksgiving to all of you and your wonderful families. And to give you a quick verse for today, it's Nehemiah 12. Nehemiah 12. And uh, <laughs> yes, we're going to go, well, we're going to go uh, verses 24 through 48. I'm, I'm giving you all of these verses because it's important to hear the story regarding Nehemiah and how he was commissioned to rebuild the wall of Jerusalem. And he did it by not only, uh, you know, as governor to sign the documents, but he, to go with a team of people. He didn't do it alone. He went with other leaders, priests, the high priest, and all. There's so many names, too many to list. But you can look up the story yourself, Nehemiah chapter 12, and read it. And what was so fascinating to me is that uh, when they were able to rebuild the walls of Jerusalem, they marched up to the top, and they had appointed choirs of thanksgiving they were called thanksgiving choirs so i you just got to read it and the praise team would praise and the choir would sing thanksgiving and they together were praising and thanking they were alternating and uh really incredible how uh they appointed two large thanksgiving choirs to walk the walls to um, you know, to pray over Jerusalem, to praise the Lord that he had given them the ability, the strength, the tools, and the wherewithal to rebuild the walls of Jerusalem after everything was destroyed under King Nebuchadnezzar's rule. And so it's so important for us to remember that we need to praise him as we are thanking him. Praise him. Tell him how wonderful he is. Tell him how much you love him. And then sing to him. Sing thanksgiving. Thanksgiving songs to him. Make up songs of how much you love him and thank him. Because the thanksgiving is what really moves the heart of God. When you praise him, it excites him. It blesses him. But when you thank him for what he has done, all the things that he has done and for what he is about to do, it will move mountains and it moves the heart of God. So let's praise him and thank him as Nehemiah and all of his people. And let's do it for our country. Let's praise him and sing to him and thank him for what he's about to do for the United States of America, not just our own personal families and friends, but what he's about to do for our nation and the whole world. Let's do that together. I love you. God bless you. Happy Thanksgiving again. Be blessed.